Hi, this is David Lalong, and today I'm going to show you how to import email and contacts from a, another email account into Gmail. So the first thing we're going to do is log into uh, the Gmail account where you want to import the contacts and email. Once that uh, comes up, you'll see the inbox view. Um, in the upper right hand corner, you may have a link that says import mail and contacts. If you don't, click on the uh, widget in the upper right hand corner, this little cogwheel, and select settings. Then go to accounts and import. And in this section, import mail and contacts, click on import mail and contacts button and in the pop-up window type in the email address for the account from which you want to import the email and contacts. So this is the one I want to use. Enter the password for that email account. It's going to sign in and verify that the uh, email address and password is correct. There's several options that you can select here. Um, I advise leaving them all uh, all checked, so you will get all the contacts from that um, from that email account imported, all the mail, um, and then all the new mail moving forward for the next 30 days. So that will help with the transition, and then um, it'll add a label in Gmail. Um, using whatever information you supply here to all those emails that get uh, pulled in. Um, I think it makes sense just leave the email address here for the old account so you can see um, clearly which which emails that those are. So you really don't have to make any changes here and um, then click start import. It's going to re-verify the uh, username and uh, password and the, the next message is basically um, letting you know that everything is okay, the message and contacts are being Im imported, and it's going to take um, a little time to, to get those in, um, sometimes up to two days. So I'm gonna close this window out, and what we're going to do is um, come back in 24 hours and uh, verify that those emails are and contacts are being imported. As you can see, um, you know there's a status update here that under import mail and contacts, this is uh, this is now taking place. So we'll come back in uh, 24 hours and then um, we'll verify that the emails are being imported. Okay, it's been about 24 hours, so let's log into the Gmail account and see where we are with the import of the email messages and the contacts. So when we log in, we can see in the inbox there's a ton of messages that have been imported. There's an alert that appears at the top here that says that contacts and messages have finished importing and new messages will be forwarded as they arrive. If you remember, we chose to have messages um, be continue to be um, forwarded to the Gmail account over the next 30 days. And this last part is there's a label that's been applied to all the messages that have been imported. So all those are in the inbox as well as in under this label on the left hand side here. So that makes it a lot easier to organize. Um, if we go into the contacts area, all the contacts have been imported from that other email account as well. So that's all set. And this is uh, this is basically all you need to do. The emails will remain in that other account in case you need to go back there. But um, you know everything has now been transitioned over to Gmail so you can start using Gmail um, as your primary email account. Um, that's that's all for for this uh, instruction. Uh, thanks for watching.